Okay, so let's leave a little bit the, the part of the booth where we speak about microcontrollers and microprocessors and the different solutions around and move so to, to, to see some of our other products. Okay, so we move to the second half of our booth. Uh, so after the microcontrollers, microprocessors, let's uh, check what do we have for, let's say, the sensors and other products. And I'm here with Zuska. So Zuska, could you tell us something about this great sensor? which you have seen a little bit already when talking about the Nano AI Studio, but here you see the hardware in action. So, good morning everyone. Here we are showcasing our new sensor. It is called ISM330IS, and it offers accelerometer and gyroscopes, but besides that, it also includes a so-called ISPU, an intelligent sensor processing unit. This means this is a uh, small but compact RISC core capable of data processing with much less power consumption than the MCU. So here on this booth, we are showcasing two demos. Specifically, we have here one demo is showcasing how we can run sensor fusion on uh, directly in the sensor. So this means we calculate the orientation in the sensor and then the BLE system on chip only collects the data and transfers it directly to the smartphone app. Then we have here also another demo, which is a combination of TMOS sensor and the ISPU. So it is a simulation of the front door and the ISPU here is uh, specifically here to detect the state of the door. This means that if I open the door, then we can see it detected by red, uh, red blinking LED. So I think this is it for a quick introduction. Uh, does SC have a long history during DSPs? DSPs, yeah, we do, because uh, <laughs> basically uh, since the processing power is, is needed uh, for different types of applications, even in the microcontrollers today, we try to include dedicated accelerators uh, to help with the calculations or fill filters, uh, uh, let's say the sinus, cosinus uh, coordinations. So yes, we do. Yes. Okay. And, uh, there keeps coming new generations of this. Sensors? Things even better in all the time. Yes, absolutely. So we, we, we listen, first of all, we listen to our customers and like this example of ISPU where we really integrate dedicated core to run the machine learning already on the sensor is already a big step through. Because in past, normally you had a sensor, you had a micro, you had a connection, PCV was bigger, more expensive. Now you can do these simple things on the one single device. All right. Thanks a lot. Thank you, Zuzka. See you later.